spend part of their spring break today helping to build a unity garden. Designers hope the completely edible garden will unite all four campuses of the new schools at Carver in southeast Atlanta. Fox Live's Patty Pan was there for the community project. <laughs> Students, YMC volunteers, and teachers today work side by side digging, planting, and laying bricks for a new unity garden in the courtyard of the new schools of Carver. The goal to unite all four schools and give more than a thousand underserved students from the schools a place to gather, relax, wow. and enjoy nature. This whole garden that we're doing is not just for the school, it's for the community, the Pittsburgh community, the Mechanicsville community, and every community surrounding those areas so that they can come here and get picked fruits and participate in building this garden. It's coming along. I'm really happy with the way it's coming together. Man you. says the garden will also have a rain harvest irrigation system making it self-sustainable. We wanted to bring them a patio courtyard space that they could hang out in and enjoy, but also pick fresh fresh root from the trees and learn to plant, plant vegetables and kind of learn about the whole food cycle, where food comes from. We have a completely sustainable source of water for the site. Um, all of the overland flow that comes into the site is being captured in an underground cistern that will then be used to pump for irrigation. While many of the children you see here today volunteer through the YMCA, others are students spending their spring break. If you volunteer, it's more better than getting paid because you have others in need and other people's part, other people probably don't have that chance. This Unity Garden is being made possible by Atlanta-based Giving Point, a youth development organization, along with funds from State Farm. This is the first phase of this project. The second phase will come in the fall where they're building an amphitheater-style classroom surrounded by vining fruits. That is the latest here in Southeast Atlanta. Patty Pan, Fox 5 News. Patty, thanks. And still ahead on Fox 5 News at 5, a man accused tonight.